let's say we have a guy in an elevator and let's say his mass is equal to 70 kilograms so that he has a weight weight which is equal to mg is equal to 70 times 9.81 meters per second squared and that is approximately equal to 686.7 newtons like that and what we want to know is if all of a sudden you start accelerating downward at 2 meters per second squared what is his apparent weight what is the reading on the scale if he's accelerating downward at 2 meters per second squared well let's look at this first of all let's say he's not accelerating just stationary or moving at a constant speed but let's say it's just stationary in the elevator then the forces acting on this guy are force due to gravity which is mg and the normal force from the elevator which is up like this I'm sorry not the elevator but the scale the normal force is the force that the scale exerts on his feet and this is what you read on the scale this is equal to W the normal force on the scale is equal to W which is just equal to mg in this case 686.7 newtons so if he starts accelerating downward then he's going to weigh less or parent weight will be less so how do we how do we handle that well we write new use newton's second law and we write the net force acting on this mass this guy here and that's mg minus fn force that the scale exerts on him has to be equal to ma so what we want to find out is Fn because that's the new weight, the apparent weight. Fn is equal to M times G minus A. It's as simple as that. And that's equal to the apparent weight. That means that his mass, 70 kilograms times 9.81, minus 2 meters per second squared is approximately equal to 546.7 546.7 newtons that's what the apparent weight is